What's up my peeps, time for a brand new episode of WB Mayhem. Now, this is the second episode of the day. If you guys missed the first one that I uploaded earlier today, the link will be in the description box. It was a Mayhem Tips video showing you guys how to level up fast, because the game now is out in most places. I say most, because it seems like people from Germany and the UK don't have access to the game yet. But I'm sure you'll have access to it pretty soon. Now, you read the title right, every single signature move for all the 1 star superstars. I finally got Enzo, Enzo was the only 1 star that I didn't have, and I finally have them all now. So, I've compiled every single signature move of all the 1 star superstars currently available in the game. So, if you find this video like a year down the line, don't go ahead and comment, Hey, you're missing this guy or this guy, this is not all the 1 star superstars. Well, of course, you know, things happen, changes happen, updates happen. This is at the time I'm recording this, this is every single 1 star signature move in the game. Now, these signature moves aren't to be confused with the special moves, the signature moves are pretty much the finishing moves they're unique to the superstars in the comment section once you've checked out all the signature moves that i show you let me know which one is your favorite for me it's between the big ending simply for the taunt afterwards and enzo certified g because it's the only signature move in the game that actually heals you uh, so it does very little damage, but it heals a good portion of your health. So anyways, I'll go ahead and play the signature moves right now, and afterwards I'll come back to you guys and I'm gonna play some events because I'm saving up for a big loot episode. Maybe not the biggest loot episode in terms of quantity, uh, but definitely the best. Uh, loot episode in terms of quality so stay tuned for that i was planning on making the loot opening today but i'm gonna go ahead and play some more events and save up even more good loot for the episode tomorrow so now let's get to the signature moves winding up for his finisher oh man the styles clash oh, we know what's coming winding up for his finisher he's going to the top rope He's taking him downtown. Winding up for his finisher. Bam! It's pandemonium in the ring. That just came out of nowhere. Uh-oh, we know what's coming. A boop, a loop, a loop, and boom. Oh, oh nice. The catapult throw. Oh, he's taking him downtown. Look at this. There it is. A Stone Cold Stunner! Brutal! I can't watch this! Hard! Oh, we know what's coming! Get off the track! Here comes the E-Train! Uh-oh! We know what's coming! Oh! The big ending! That'll be heard all around the world! Heavens to Betsy! Bam! Bam! coming oh my f5 he's taking him downtown and look at this he's setting up his opponent a uh, five knuckle shuffle that'll be heard all around the world rejected oh we know what's coming the attitude adjustment oh we know what's coming bam there you go trouble in paradise this a boop a loop a loom bam boom S-O-S! This is the move that makes him famous! First! Ah, signature move! Oh, look out! Buckle Bomb! Oh, he's taking him downtown! Last chance! I believe this is happening! He's setting up his opponent! Bam! That'll be heard all around the world! I have seen it all tonight! Look at this! Look at this, he's gone berserk! Welcome to the honor roll! He's taking him downtown! Oh, we know what's coming! Oh, lost in the woods! Oh, that was brutal! I can't watch this! Look at this! He's setting up his opponent! Oh, cannonball! One last chance! Uh-oh, we know what's coming! heard all around the world look at this ah, he's just gone berserk he's on a rampage look out below the gd 
DDT. That'll be heard all around the world. Get up. Did he really just fall for that? The cane choke slam. That'll be heard all around the world. Look at this. Ooh, tombstone pile driver. All right, so right off the bat, I want to show you guys what I've got ready to go for the next episode's loot opening. So this is kind of a sneak peek, or actually it's not just a sneak peek, it's a full reveal, kind of, because I'm about to get some more loot right now. So, uh, the Delhi one, okay, the Versus one, okay, the Event one, okay, 2 star one, eh. But I got a 3 star one, on top of that I got a premium one, and this is where the really good stuff comes in. Because I've got a wildcard one. This was part of a daily offer. I went ahead and got two of them. There's potential to get a four star out of this. Uh, same with the premium as well. And I've got two brawler ones. Also part of a daily offer. Got two of those. So that's just what I currently got. Now there's events going on for a Smackdown loot case and a Raw loot case. I'm closing in on a Raw case and also a Smackdown one. Although I should already have a Raw and Smackdown one. But... There was some sort of bug uh, prior to this recent update where I wasn't getting my loot case keys. So I'm definitely going to contact support about that because I'd like to get my keys and get more briefcases because, hey, these are potentially four star superstars. But anyways, I'm about to get some more of them uh, through the newer Raw and SmackDown events. So this right here is to get myself a raw loot case. One thing I did notice is the update also added in some new moves for some superstars, new special moves. For instance, AJ has a high angle senton now, I believe, or dive. Uh, oh, there it is right there. So that's new. AJ didn't have that prior to the update. So next up, we got Cena, Bork Laser, Protein Shake. Although it looks more like a 5 hour energy, which by the way, that's like one of the nastiest energy drinks out there. Finn Balor, Mystery, which is basically you pick a superstar that you want to face off against, Kalisto, some cash, a Big Cass, and a Braun Strowman and Cesaro. Some cash and Big Cass kind of rhymes, I like that. Begin, let's go. A lot of attacks. Man, what I really like about AJ in this game is his attacks are quick, unlike Brock Lesnar. So most of the time, instead of going for the typical, you know, light attacks, I'm going for the medium attacks. Just medium after medium after medium. I'm gonna try and hit a signature move here. Uh, most of the time you'll notice that I don't hit signature moves. Uh, I just don't use them most of the time. I mostly reverse and go for special moves instead. I'll talk about that in maybe a future episode. Uh, but, well, Frog Splash and... Okay, success. Six, okay. Nope, spoke too soon. Wasn't a success. Let's... Alright, he, he's already done. Oh, no, 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 I didn't want to go for strong attack. See, I tried to stop it. I was like, oh, I'm already holding the button or, you know, holding the screen. So it was too late. Uh, it was too late for me to say, never mind, let me use the SOS instead. But whatever, we win the match. Let's go. Finn versus... Who should it be? We're going to go Kofi again because I want to hit Trouble in Paradise or SOS. And it might just be over here. I hope not. Let's see. Frog. Okay, Danger Pin. Hey. If I can win, I'm going to win right now. Okay, and there we go. Okay, so now we've got to pick a match. It's either Samoa Joe, a 173, or Bray Wyatt, 103. Here's the thing, Samoa Joe gives you 39 cash. He's a stronger superstar, right? Um, keep in mind, you get 100 keys, 25 XP. Let's take a look at Bray Wyatt here. Oh, nope, I picked him instead of just checking the rewards. Let's take a look at Bray. Same rewards, except you get one more cash. For a weaker superstar, alright, I'm taking it. So, gonna take on Bray with Brock Lesnar. Time for Bray to lose another feud. Powerbomb, and it's over for Bray. One, two, three. Kaliso, Brock's about to do some bad lucha things to you right now. I think Brock is gonna be in the danger. Oh no, he's not in danger pin now. But, um, I should maybe take out Kaliso now. I've let him get too much offense in. And, uh, Brock is almost at danger pin, so... Let's win it. Yup. Okay. Now, time to finish this. Reversal. Doesn't matter. It's over. And it's going to be a submission hold. So Brock's going to put him in the Boston Crab. And Lisa's going to tap. He's going to break his back. It's over. So I just picked up this cash. And now it's time to move on. It's a big cast. I only said that because it rhymed. Frog Splash. Shooting. Okay. Shooting Star Press. 
I do hope that they add in, you know, some um, moves like the Phoenix Splash for somebody like Seth Rollins. I think it'd be, you know, more suited for Rollins instead of the Shooting Star Press. I think he's already got the Frog Splash, so he's just missing the Phoenix Splash. So now we're gonna be fighting for the WWE Championship in a tag match out of all match types. Now, I'm glad that- okay. Okay, what's he going for? Shotgun drop kick. Okay. Now, I'm glad that it's not Brock versus Braun once again at the Rumble. We already saw Brock versus Braun, and I didn't want to see Braun lose again. Because Braun versus Brock again would just lead to Brock beating Braun again. So now it seems like they're going to go for a triple threat with Kane involved. I'm cool with that. And actually, if it was going to be a one-on-one -on -one match, I would have rather seen Kane versus Brock for the simple fact that, you know, we haven't seen that before. We haven't seen Kane versus Brock one-on-one. -on -one. Um, but I think triple threat might just be the best decision, the best move. So let's go here. And okay, up, up, and up. Okay, Bron gets out of it. Let me switch out to Seth Rollins. Don't want Brock to get any more damage. And it should be, it, it's okay. He switched out to Cesaro. Either way, we're going to end this. We're going to win this and take that WWE Championship home. So let's go. Just a couple more medium attacks. Same thing with Seth Rollins that I do with AJ. I mostly go for medium attacks because they're pretty quick. Okay, he's stunned and it's going to be over. He strikes and I'm going to strike back. And is he going to strike? Nope. Superplex. Cool. There we go. So Seth, what's it going to be now? Okay, DDT. Now, out of all the moves, the DDT is probably the most realistic move in the game. It's not exaggerated, it's just a normal DDT. And now, we are the champion, at least for 9 minutes and a couple seconds. Now, the event that I'm really interested in completing is the Unstoppable Giant event against The Undertaker. The rating is 4K, so pretty much just like the Unstoppable Legend one with The Rock, um, and the rewards are pretty decent, a um, 3 star or 500 3 star keys for the superstar difficulty. On normal you get 500 premium, I would actually maybe prefer the 500 premium, for the simple fact that you can possibly get a 4 star out of that. When it comes to this one, there's no potential 4 star, but it is a guaranteed 3 star, and when it comes to the beginner, it's 2 star um, keys. So, definitely going to go for that in one of the next episodes. There's a lot of time left for this event, so I'm likely going to go ahead and complete the Disaster event as well as the Breakout event first. And overload Clash of Champions. All of, oh, Clash of Champions, two days left though. Oh, this one is four hours left, the Power Dash one. Uh, this one has Powerhouse class rewards, so I might want to go ahead and actually complete that before I complete anything else first. Uh, target rating is a lot lower than the other ones. So yeah, chances are I'm going to go ahead and I'll finish this first because it's going to end soon. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, click the like button down below. And with that said, I'm out guys. See ya.